Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Maritza. So today we're actually at the doctor. We just got to, let me kind of show you guys. It's pretty big. It's actually a new building, but it is like an urgent care. Let's go. I'm bringing David because he's been having like a cough and take the hat and a fever and the cough is like making him throw up but I'm gonna go inside so I'm gonna I'm gonna bring you guys along David sit down all right you guys so they just put us in the room and I don't want to talk too loud so that they don't hear me David is doing fine it's just he doesn't have a fever right now as we speak but hopefully we'll just see what they say and by the way, you guys, look at these little masks. Well, this one's like for a baby, and then this is for like a, an adult. But David was wearing this one, and I was wearing this one because I'm also sick. I have a cough as well. So pretty much they said we we're fine. They're just going to give us like cough syrup and stuff like that. And um, David David has double ear infection. Oh, my love. Oh. So we're going to get like some medicine for that as well. How do you feel, David? You feel good? Yeah? Okay, so let's go. Okay, guys, so we're back in our car. David, can you say hi? David, look. Say hi. Sorry, it's like a little bit dark back there. Don't pull on the door. Good thing I have child lock. Lock. Good thing I have child lock on, and I'm about to lock the door. But basically, they just told us. Let me actually read the paper. So I was there to be seen as well, but mostly there for David. For me, it was just an acute upper respiratory infection. Um, so they're just gonna give me like, um, basically like pseudoephedrine and allergy relief. Um, I think it's like the, I think like nasal spray and stuff like that. And also ibuprofen for like headaches and body aches. Cause I also told them I've been having body aches and a headache from pretty much the same like respiratory infection and for David they also said it was the same thing an acute upper respiratory infection and an infection in both ears actually so they're giving him amoxicillin pretty much that's it um, she just did she did also recommend that we use like a humidifier and thankfully nothing too bad but he does have the infection so we're hoping that the medicine will work for that as well so we're gonna head to the pharmacy now and we're gonna go pick up the medicine that they prescribed so we will see you guys there let's go david let's go we're just going into cvs you guys to get his medicine so i'll talk to you guys later. Right, so we went to cvs to the pharmacy but they didn't have our medicine ready um it was gonna be like 30 to 40 minutes or 30 to 45 minutes they said so we came to Jack in the Box and we're about to order. Yeah. David, are you hungry? Yes. Yes? Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and eat and then probably go back to CVS. But yeah, we're gonna get some Jack. I'm thinking of getting, what do you guys normally get from Jack in the Box, by the way? I really wanna know. Um, because I always get the same thing. I get the extreme sausage. Oh gosh, it's my turn to order. And I wanted to get the iced coffee, but probably not because it's too strong. Hey, Jack in the Box, ready? Um, yes. Can I do the number twenty-six, the extreme sausage? I doubt for the combo. Um, with the combo, please. Yeah, what kind of treat would you like with that? Can I just do a sprite? Yes, you can. Can I do a small sprite? And I'll do one extra hash brown, please. Yeah, one extra hash brown sprite. And I think I'm also gonna do. Um, let me see. Do you guys have the churros? Oh, yeah. Can I do the five piece of the churros? Five piece churros. There we go. And that's it. Have you ordered Kittle Screen? Um, yes. Alright. So we'll look at the bottom. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, so we're gonna get our food. We'll talk to you guys later. Okay, so we are back. We came and parked real quick because we're gonna eat. Um, I just got David one hash brown because I feel like that's all I will eat. And especially because he like coughs a lot and is kind of nauseous. Um, but yeah, I'm like, why not bring you guys along to us eating now? Hey, David, look, it's yours, look. And I feel like sometimes the hash browns are a little bit greasy, so I always like pat it 
because I don't want it to eat like too much oily foods and like greasy foods but yeah I also got churros because if, at least if he doesn't eat this hopefully he'll at least want like something sweet or something little pieces there you go hopefully he doesn't throw up because he's sick and he's been coughing a lot so it'll make him throw up I keep saying he's sick you guys already know that so I just took David off is it good I just took David off his car seat because he was about to start throwing up. He threw up a little bit, but nothing major. What do you guys give your kids, or what do you guys do when your kids are sick? I know, like, a certain age, you can give them certain medicines, but certain ages, you can't yet. So, what do you guys give your kids if they're, like, toddlers? Okay, I think we're just going to eat, you guys. And David's, like, running all over the place back there. So, I'm going to go ahead and just finish eating, and then I'll talk to you guys in a minute. All right, you guys, so I don't know where I left you guys off at. Um, we did have to run a few errands. The medicine wasn't ready when we first went and picked it up, then we went to eat, and then we've ran more errands since then, so it's a few hours later. David's back there, he already took a nap, he woke up, he actually felt sick still, and he's been like throwing up, but not a lot, and not, not like just throw up, but he'll throw up from too much coughing so i think that's just what it is it's probably just the cough i'm going to show you guys all the medicine that we have that we just went and picked up from cvs i'm literally outside of cvs right now i don't think you guys can see it actually but um we're finally headed home once we're home i'll show you guys what we got and david can you say hi yes. say hi hi so he's feeling a little bit better although he is still sick I'm fine so all it is whenever I get sick is I'll get like a headache along with like cough and cold and just all those symptoms but we're doing good um so yeah we're gonna go home now and we'll just see you guys when we're home okay so we are finally home now I wanted to quickly show you guys everything we got so it's literally <clears throat> this big bag of um, medicine it's obviously not full but they gave it to us like in the biggest bag so let me kind of show you guys. Okay, so the first medicine was amoxicillin. This is all they gave David. So I was like, obviously, you know, that's gonna help with like the earaches and stuff, but at least for his throat, I got him these. And we already opened it um, and he was already eating one. I honestly didn't even know they made these until one of my friends from church showed me, or like she gave them to her daughter. Yes? Oh, it's okay. And I'm like, I wonder if they work. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try these out. And then I also bought David this. This is just like Robitussin. Um, and I did get it in the age, it says it's ages four and over. David's two and a half. So I'm not gonna give him the full dosage, but. And David is back there on his little Mercedes. Say hi. Hi. But um, we had it inside because it was charging. But anyways, so this is all for David. Okay, and then for myself, I got like this cough syrup, um, this nasal spray, and then just ibuprofen. So yeah, guys, that's all they gave us, all of this stuff. So hopefully we'll feel better pretty soon. Hey guys, so it is the next day, and we just got home from Walmart, and I thought I would include this clip because I wanted to actually show you guys what else we went and bought real quick. So we just got home from buying a few things because David is still pretty sick. Um, I'm still sick, but not so much. It's mostly just him. He doesn't want to really eat. So, um, we got this humidifier. We have a different humidifier, but it throws, like, cool mist. So, I did decide to buy this one because it's supposed to be, like, a uh, warm steam. So, so, here. And I also got this to go with it, which is supposed to be, like, a cough suppressant. And you're able to use this, like, with hot steam humidifiers. So, this is it right here. And then I also bought a bunch of Pedialyte. Um, David really likes the purple one, so I got two of these. And I just thought if he doesn't like that flavor one, I'll just mix this with like some apple juice or something because he really likes apple juice. And I just got this one just in case. And we also got some chicken noodle soup and star soup. Um, this one was only 50 cents each. And then this one was like 128. So I'm like, why not? Okay, I'm just gonna try one of these if he for some reason doesn't like it. Obviously this is a lot cheaper, so I just got two of these. And then I also got some uh, zucchinis or like squash because I'm gonna make caldo de pollo in a bit. This obviously has nothing to do with our being sick, but I actually just got some decaf coffee and there's like the Starbucks one, the cake cut pods. And then we also got some Germex just because we don't wanna spread the germs anymore. 
Um, I was thinking I got these little Kool-Aids because I was thinking if he doesn't want to drink his Pedialyte, I can at least mix it with Kool-Aid. And then hopefully he drink it like that. And then I also got these little Pediatures here. I just got a six pack. Um, he does typically drink these, but I know you're not supposed to give him like milk and stuff when they have a fever. And he has been having a fever almost every day, so I just got a six pack for now. And then I also got this thing of orange juice, just so hopefully it'll help him, you know, with the vitamin C and stuff. So, yeah guys, this is all we got. But, um, I'm honestly feeling a lot better. Um, he does look a little bit better from yesterday. He doesn't have like a runny nose anymore. It's mostly just the fever and then him not wanting to eat. And still a cough, but not too, too much. So I'm hoping that humidifier will help with that. And obviously the Pedialyte and stuff is all for him not wanting to eat. So we'll see how he does. So that is pretty much it for this video, you guys. I thought I would just include today's um, little clip of like the stuff that I just bought in here. Because it is about us being sick. So I um, hope you guys enjoy the video. And wish us luck. Hopefully we get better fast and thank you guys all so much for watching if you guys are new to my channel be sure to subscribe down below um we're almost at 2,000 subscribers whenever we do hit 2,000 i did want to go ahead and do a giveaway for you guys to give back to you guys and also if you guys are already subscribed but don't have your little uh, notification bell turned on then i do suggest you guys turn that on and you guys won't miss out on any videos that i post thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you guys in the next video bye